In 2014, due to the outbreak of a military conflict in the territory of Donbass, the operation of the Novozovska wind power turbine was suspended. The total capacity of the wind farm was 105 megawatt. The power plant was a wind farm of 42 turbines with a capacity of 2.5 megawatt for each. In 2019, a proposal was made to resume energy production from the facility, but this was impossible due to the lack of professionals in this field and outdated algorithms for controlling the wind generator. The aim of this work is to develop an energy-efficient control system for a wind turbine installation, as well as the implementation of an electromechanical model of a wind turbine in order to educate and train future professionals in the field of wind turbine management. The structure of the wind turbine control system consists of two loops, nested loop, torque and speed. The torque nested loop is presented in the form of field-oriented control for a non-silent pole, permanent magnet synchronous machine with current regulators controller along the D and Q axis. They are set to the technical optimum and their coefficients are calculated according to the following formula. The speed nested loop is represented by two regulators, the angle of rotation of the blade and the speed. The contour of the blade angle control can be represented as a proportional position controller and the speed nested loop of the rotation mechanism. Before proceeding to setting up the speed controller of the wind turbine, it is worth paying attention to its non-linear properties. For the correct operation of the wind turbine control system, it is necessary to accurately calculate the resulting non-linearity. And for this, it is necessary to accurately predict the balance of the power factor when changing the angle of rotation of the blade and the specified speed. Therefore, to solve this problem, it was proposed to use a neural network. It has a three-layer structure, which is characterized by a hyperbolic tangent function, the output of which is calculated by the formula. The speed controller of the wind turbine is presented in discrete form with a period equal to the time of the nested loop of the angle of rotation of the blade. Its peculiarity is in adapting to the parameters of the wind turbine that change during operation, such as speed, power factor and wind speed. This regulator is set to a symmetrical optimum and has the following coefficients. As a result of modeling, the following transients were obtained. The wind speed database obtained from the sensor at the Novozovska wind power turbine was considered as a load. As you can see, in the period from 0 to 3 seconds, the wind generator accelerates in the motor mode, consuming active power. Then it runs at idle for 2 seconds, after which the load is applied and the wind turbine switches to partial load mode. In this mode, the active power line of the generator tries to repeat the power line of the wind flow in order to select the maximum power. The installation works until the wind speed reaches the nominal value, after which the wind turbine speed nested loop turns on. In full load mode, with an increase in wind speed, the active power of the generator becomes less than the power of the wind flow and is limited at the nominal level, as is the speed of the generator. This is realized by adjusting the angle of rotation of the blade, which in partial load mode was zero. During the operation of the system, the speed controller maintains the nominal rotation speed of the wind turbine by means of the blade angle, and the generator torque control circuit maintains power in accordance with the task. I believe that this development will speed up the commissioning process of the Novozovska wind power turbine and the possibility of training highly qualified professionals in the field of wind turbine management. Thank you for your attention.